Oh my god, we actually made it here. Is this... Is this the top of Temporal Tower? What? Lightning! Lightning returns? Ugh! Look at the sky, Jay. It's incredible. Red clouds are swirling. What happened again? The tower feels like it's going to shake apart at any moment. Let's hustle. Time to die. Look, over there. What could this be? It has a strange mystical feel. There's a big circular pattern. Inside are indentations that look like they've been gouged out. What is this? Wait a second. The gouged out indentations. There are five in all. Five slots? That means... What? Five slots? That's it. If I set all five time gears in these five slots, we might prevent time from stopping. Okay, I'll do it. Not before we, you know, do our trivial boss fight of destruction, death, and pain. And it goes dark for no reason. I, I don't know, I don't know what to go with for Primal Dialga. I'm just gonna let you read that. What? You're wrong. We're here to prevent time from stopping. I I don't know what to go with here. Like I'm thinking like give it a like really growly deep deep guy voice like time stopping. Like like that. Like time. Roar. Dialga. You... you dare bring ruin to the tower! No, that's wrong. We want to prevent the tower from collapsing. Silence! For all those who threaten Temporal Tower, I will show no mercy! It's no use, Jay. He's not listening to us at all. Dialga's losing control because time is breaking down. But this isn't like Primal Dialga in the future. He's not fully, he's not yet fully consumed by the power of darkness. There's still a chance that Dialga can be brought back to reason. There's still hope. Here he comes, Jay! Time for the final battle. I want to see if we can survive a roar of time. That's priority number one. Because he always uses Roar of Time on the first turn. Nope, we don't survive it. Wait, that was a critical hit. Bullshit. But if that's the case, then we just... <sighs> wow, man. Wow, man. That essentially means we probably would have died anyway. See you guys back at the top of the tower. All right, so we're we're back in the game. Um, and I don't even I don't even know. Like, uh, he didn't use he didn't use Roar of Time on the first turn. That's weird, because he usually does. But I'm not, I'm not gonna say anything about it. I'm just gonna go in. Wow. <laughs> wow. Yikes, man. Um... Blaze? What was that, a crit? Like, why is he critting on every attack? 
<laughs> I don't get it. I really don't get it. I'm trying to do it without grinding, but like, it's not working. No, it's not. What? Huh? Why is it playing the- <laughs> I didn't do this. I already did this. Oh, you know what? Maybe it's because I went back down to the bottom of the Temporal Tower to, like, get items and grind. Okay, we've already seen this. So this should not be at all. <laughs> so, final boss time. We <laughs> I, I grinded, I grinded, I grinded, I grinded. And I just literally, literally didn't want to want to put up with the nonsense. Okay, so it's either going to be Roar of Time or he's going to move. Alright. That's exactly what I wanted. So here's the deal. Sleepy time. Okay, Wolf, well, you see you see you you need you need to take those moves off and now that he's asleep here's another oh shocks oh shocks oh shocks good thing I have two orum berries for that um I have to. I can do one more round of damage before he goes. Uh, before I put him back to sleep. Because he'll still not be able to move this turn. So, nighty night. Eat me! Eat me! Three minutes! No lie, motherfucker! <laughs> Eat me! Eat me! Eat me! You can't! You can't. Don't mess with me! I brought six Reviver Seeds for this! I brought six! Eat me alive, Primal Dialga! Eat me! You can't! You really can't though! You really can't! <sighs> well that... That's, that's how I feel about your whole life. Can't mess with me. I don't care how many times you make me restart. I did it. I did it. I grinded to 43 for flamethrower. I grinded to 43 for flamethrower. Just to beat you. Don't mess with me. Can't mess with me. Too good, too strong. Too good, too strong. We... we did it. Okay, Jay, it's time. While Dialga is still down, I'll go put in the time gears. What? You'd better hurry up. This 
this tremor is the worst it's been. Temporal tower is temporal tower must be nearing total collapse. If if that were to happen, the destruction would accelerate until the planet is fully paralyzed. I've gotta hurry. Eric, the floor is heavy ink. It's hard to put the time gears into place. Done. They're all set. Ah! Why? I put the time gears where they're supposed to go. Why won't the tremor stop? It can't be. Was I too late? Will the temporal tower continue to collapse? Is it too late to stop the planet's paralysis? Ugh. This is... This is the end! Or not. Where? Wolf. I mean, I mean, what did you expect? I mean, of course we were on time because we're the best. Hey, Jay. Where? This is Temporal Tower. Is that Dialga? You have no cause for alarm. I have regained my reason. What? Temporal Tower has taken heavy damage, but it has survived. Now, observe. Roar! This is... Dialga must be showing this to us. He's using telepathy to do so. Hey, the dewdrops are falling again. This must be Tree Shroud Forest. But it's not the same. When we were in Tree Shroud Forest, time was stopped. Time is... Time is moving again. It's treasure- oh, whoops! It's treasure town, I'm getting distracted. Everyone looks happy. It's Temporal Tower. Seems to be badly damaged, but it's still standing. I apologize about that interruption, you know. Things happen. So where were we? Oh yeah, Temporal Tower didn't collapse. It survived! Temporal Tower survived the crisis. Time has returned to normal here. Thus, time has resumed in places where I has stopped. Because you stopped the ruin of Temporal Tower, the planet's paralysis has been prevented. The world's peace has been restored. Really? We did it, Jay! We finally did it! We brought peace to the world! Allow me to thank you. I thank you for reaching the Hidden Land. You had the courage to stand up to me even as I raged out of control. And you prevented the ruin of Temporal Tower in the nick of time. Thank you. All this I owe to you. Dialga. But all is not as all is not yet as it should be. It will take time. I must see to the repair of Temporal Tower. The hidden land too has been ravaged. But the Rainbow Stone Ship should still be operable. And Lapras should be awaiting your return. Okay. Let's go home, Jay. Back to Treasure Town.
What's the matter, Jay? Let's hurry. My body feels heavy. What's wrong? Why am I struggling to move? It's like my legs are weighed down. Maybe now that we change the future, my own disappearance is drawing near. Tremors! It settled down. I guess things are still settling back to normal. Let's go, Jay. This... This light. Alright. Finally. The time has finally arrived. My time with Wolf... Ends now. Hey, Jay! Huh? Jay! What is it? What's wrong with you? Sorry, Wolf. I kept this to myself for a long time. It looks like I have to say goodbye. That's the only time they do. That's the only time they do the thing where the character actually like says words out loud instead of thinking them or like putting them in quotation. Or uh, is that what they're called? No, not not quotation marks. Um, in parentheses. Huh. Well. It's, it's nice, I, I feel the power from that, like, that alone. I think, I... TBH, like, this scene when I first saw it, I, I, I actually cried because... Well, you'll see. Well, I mean, you already see, because, because you know, the, the main protagonist, Poke, is disappearing and... It's obviously gonna shake Wolf to his very core. But enough talking. Um, what? Goodbye? What do you mean? Dustin Ware told me. If we change the future, the Pokemon from the future would disappear. That's why I'm destined to disappear too. Huh? What? What? Why? 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 I don't understand. Thank you for everything. I'm going to disappear from here now, but Wolf, I'll never forget you. Wait a second. I only made it this far because you were here with me, Jay. Don't you understand? You made me strong. If you go, I... I don't know what I would... No, Wolf. You have to be strong on your own. You have to live. You have to go home. Tell everyone about what happened here, so that nothing like this ever happens again. Uh, Jay? The light. It's get- the light is getting brighter. Don't, Jay, don't- don't go! Thank you for everything, Wolf. I'm glad we got to train together at the guild. I'm glad we got to go on adventures together. I'm glad- I got to know you. Wait, Jay! I'm sorry. I'm so lucky that you were my friend. I feel the same, Jay. To me, Jay, you're more important than anything. Yes, I feel the same way. Wolf, even after I disappear from here, I will never forget you. Jay, Jay! What is this? Another interruption? Of course. Of course. Uh, I'm so triggered. Why would they... <laughs> Why would they interrupt me now? Man, you know that feeling, like... When you're in the middle of something, you know... Like, you're, you're all up in your feelings, and then... You just get interrupted right in the middle. And your vibe is just killed and I'm slightly feeling that right now but that still doesn't make the scene not powerful powerful enough to get me back in my feelings so let's let's get on with it um 
did I, did I say this line? Yeah, no. Whatever. Yeah, there we go. J. Oh, here's here's a no, no. It doesn't advance by itself. It only happens once. I have to live. I have to get home alive. Get home. And tell everyone about what happened. Because it's Jay's. It's Jay's last wish. There's. Oh, there, there it's going. The Rainbow Stone ship. It's a bad thing by itself. Temporal Tower is getting farther and farther away. And Jay. Getting farther away from Jay. Damn, son. Ooh, I'm so in my feelings. Um, okay. And so Jay and Wolf finally succeeded in their mission and saved the world from disaster. Wolf departed from Temporal Tower, traveled across the ravaged hidden land, rode Lapras across the sea, and safely returned to Treasure Town. Upon returning to the guild, Wolf told everyone about the adventure, and what happened in the Hidden Land, and what took place in Temporal Tower, about Grovile, and about Jay. Of course, Wolf also spoke of how the destruction of time was stopped, and how the world was restored to peace. Wolf told the story whenever and wherever possible. To as many Pokemon as possible. It was a story that had to be told. It was a story of hope for world peace. It was a story for hope of- oh, wait, what? Did I already read that? No, never mind. It was a story of hope for future peace. Yeah. So months passed. Treasure Town returned to its cheerful routines. The scars from the planet's injury slowly healed, and life gradually returned to normal. Huh? How did Wolf going out? I can't even remember Beedoo's voice. Damn, son. Yeah, out for a walk. Sounds nice, yup yup. It'll be dinner time soon though. You wouldn't don't want to be late for that. Okay. Understood. Oh wow, this is beautiful. I haven't seen this for a long time. It's as beautiful as I remember. I've just been too busy to come and see it. But I've missed this. Fantastic sight. I wonder when it was 
uh, I wonder when it was when I last saw this. The last time was. Oh, the last time I saw this, it was when when I met Jay. The view was like that, uh, like this, that time, too. The crabby blowing all those bubbles along the beach. I noticed someone right here. Jay was unconscious. That was when... And I... Oh, fuck. Uh, when Jay and I... Uh, that was when our adventure began. I remember it all so fondly. All those memories of my time with Jay. Memories of Jay. But now, Jay is gone. And he isn't here anymore. Ah, Wolf! No, oh, shoot. I still can't do Vidu's voice. Um. You've been gone so long, I went uh, so long, I took to worrying about you. Well, what's the matter? Beedoof! Beedoof! I'm not an effective crier. Ah, what, what, what all is the matter?
and that's a <laughs> Damn, man. That shit really does make me feel some type of way, I'm not gonna lie. Like, I don't know if it sounds really juvenile. Because it kinda is, but, I mean, feeling like you know, a surge of emotion, like, from a scene in a children's game, but I can't help it, like, I actually find that kind of sad, because, you know, it's like, in certain ways, you can kind of relate to that in life, and I feel like if you don't feel something from that scene, like, you're just... You're just a monster, okay? You're a monster, you're a terrible person, I- I feel SICK! But besides that, like... What else can I say about this game? Like, what else can I say? Like... The story is... phenomenal. Honestly. I mean, it's- it's kind of weird, like... I think, I said it earlier on, I was like, this game is surprisingly, like, grim dark, sort of, or like, really adultish for such a juvenile, like, game itself. Like, you see, you, 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 like, read the narrative, and you see just how, like, see how, like, uh, adult, adult-ish the story is, and I think it, I think the story just holds up to, like, now, any day. It's just that fucking good, like, I, I can't, I can't say that enough, like, this game is amazing, this game is amazing. If you're if you're into like rogue like dun dungeon crawlers, or if you're just invested in the story, the story's just the best fucking part of this game. It, I I love the story. Not to mention the music, man. I'll hum any of these tracks any day. Um, I. I I don't know. My my biggest gripe is honestly like the end the end game with Temporal Tower. And all the all the post-game stuff and everything before Temporal Tower, besides Brian Cave, depending, is completely fine. But Temporal Tower, if you end up like me, um and being really underleveled, which in most cases does happen. It's just a fucking bitch, and I hate it. Like, fuck Porygon Z, fuck Porygon, fuck Discharge. <laughs> it's it's all really really shitty. But that's just my only complaint. But we got we got Dialga about to do something for us, so. Wolf, when you left here, when you bid farewell to this place from the Rainbow Stone Ship, your sorrow, I felt its intensity even here. And if that's how you feel even now, if Jay were to share those feelings, I will grant your wish. The world needs you both. That is why I will trust you with a gift. I leave to you the future. This is my thanks. Please accept it.
Mm. I don't know what to say about that, man. Like, that's one hell of a finale, man. And even then, there's still there's still more after this. Like, like we got a we got like a whole like post game thing with like more dungeons and more story and more more everything. And it's like, god damn, we're not we're only halfway through, my people. Only halfway through. But besides that, besides that, it's like. There's nothing that's gonna be, you know, making me, making me want to cry. Like that's about it. Um, I, I'm gonna do the post game stuff, but I'm technically gonna call this the truish finale. Like I'm actually gonna put that in parentheses. I'm gonna be like, this is the real finale, and then I'll have the post game finale. It's gonna be lit. So, uh, I can't really sign off, can I? Because we're not done. Fuck. Okay. So, I appreciate you people for watching, and I'll see you next time.